black people, we got to stop depending on whites to save us. And I understand, you know, um, we have to do things on our own. We can't rely on on white people to uh, to basically help us with everything that we should be doing ourselves. We can't depend on whites to make our neighborhoods look good. We can't depend on we can't depend on them to make our lives right. We can't always depend on them to give us a raise. You know what I'm saying? We can't always depend on you know uh depend on everything. Because us as blacks, we gotta stick together. We have to stick together. We have to make things better. We can't depend on them. Yeah, we may work for them. Yeah, they give us our checks and stuff like that. And, you know what I'm saying? We could always have our own business. We should have our own businesses. We can't just depend on a white company. Yeah, it's good. We have to have that white company to get money. You know what I'm saying? For the short term time to depend on them. But you can't depend on them every single time. You know what I'm saying? And, you know what I'm saying? And I understand it's a white world out there. We all understand that. But you don't have to have that as your life. You know what I'm saying? So we can have a lot more say-so on this. If we are, if we not scared, because there's a lot of blacks that are scared to take uh, advantage of opportunities that they do have, and you get told by people and white people that you ain't, you ain't this, you not that. Black people, you are, you have so many opportunities now. It's not even funny, and it's just we have to stop the excuses. You know what I'm saying? We have to stop getting lazy. We got to start depending on each other. Stop depending on whites. Okay? Stop depending on white people for us to get ahead. We have to say so to do whatever we want to do if we put our minds to it. If we save our money in the workplaces that we work at. We can do whatever we can. We got to stop depending on white people. And white people, stop looking down on blacks. Y'all have this thing about looking down on blacks. And Paul Mooney said something uh, in his comedy thing that I, you know, that I, that, that I have to bring up too. And this is the thing about white people. Why is it that you don't want blacks in your neighborhood, but when you own us, we was in your house? And that's true. Like, you owned us, we was in your house, did everything. You know what I'm saying? Now, we free. You don't want us around your neighborhoods, your businesses, or anything like that. So that's another reason why you can't depend on them because a lot of them don't like blacks being around they being around them. They'll they'll hire them for for different jobs, like uh, general labor jobs and stuff like that. But as far as corporate jobs. A lot of them ain't going to want to deal with blacks. You know what I'm saying? That's my issue with whites. That's my many issues with white people. So, and I'm going to get on white people. Oh, boy, I'm going to get on them. But, again, man, y'all got to stop depending on whites to let them, uh, you know, let them take over your lives when you don't have to. You have a say-so on what you do. You have a say so on, your, on what you bring to the table, saving your money for a business, just doing whatever you can. You know what I'm saying? You can own something, black people. Just put your mind into it. Stop depending on them. You know what I'm saying? Stop depending on them. But, uh, just wanted to make that this quick video. I know I didn't say much, but make it short and sweet man I'm gonna holler at y'all in a minute and stop depending on, on white people to get you where you need to go you can go wherever you can go blacks
I'm with you 100%. I want to see my black people succeed. I don't want to talk. I don't want to talk down to them. I know sometimes I feel like I talk down to my own people, but it's just a reality check. I don't want them to dumb themselves down to get accepted and to do things that they really don't want to do. You can don't dumb yourself down. Please don't dumb yourself down. So on that note, I'm gonna holler at y'all in a minute, man. Peace out.